a warm welcome to yet another Shrine Guide video here on the Proximus Gaming YouTube channel. My name is Michael and in this video the Daka Tus Shrine, also known as Sunken Scoop. This shrine, the Daka Tus Shrine, is located in the southwestern marshy area of Leneru past the Leneru Tower on Shrine Island. This island is patrolled by several enemies, such as a guardian. We start at the Leneru Tower. Look to the southwest area and there in the distance you can already see the shrine. But it's not so easy to head straight towards it because there are lots and lots of enemies there. That's why we jump off and glide towards the other side where a mountain is or a hill. Just glide all the way towards it. The reason I'm going this way is because I want to avoid enemies as much as possible. I'm a lover not a fighter. I don't like to fight. When you land, just walk towards the wall and climb up there. By the way, if you think this guide is helpful, then please give it a thumbs up, because that helps with the discoverability of this video a lot. What also helps with discoverability and with making the channel grow is to subscribe to the channel if you have not done that already. If you subscribe you won't miss any future content such as other guides and other upcoming amazing videos here on the Proximus Gaming YouTube channel. When you're up just head to the right, to the southwest area and just go towards the pointer we placed. I also stream games such as Zelda live on Twitch. Feel free to check it out, link to my Twitch channel is in the description down below. Just glide towards the other side here and climb up. Just make sure it's not raining because then you won't make it and you will fall down. Just keep continuing. Almost there. Here at the point where at the left are some rocks you can break with a bomb, jump off and glide towards the shrine. As you can see here in the right there is a guardian, a moving guardian, and we don't want to fight that one. And when you reach the little island with the shrine on it, you can see some enemies already. Lissolvo's enemies. Kill them with your sword or your bow or or what other way you want to do it. And when you finish them, we made it. Let's go in. To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am Dakatush. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I offer this trial, Sunken Scoop, Dakatush Shrine. What we want to do, there needs to be placed a ball and there are three balls in the water. 
get your magnesis rune, get the pole out of the water, and scoop up one of the poles. Alright. And put it right in there. Make sure you empty the bowl. And then when the bowl is in the hole, the gate opens. What I think is easiest is to scoop another bowl here. Just walk through the gate. And there we can see another part where the ball needs to be placed. But it's closed. So it's pretty much impossible to get that ball inside of the hole right now. So just make sure you release the ball. And just tap it. Just tap the ball so it's not on the edge anymore. Very well. Now just release the ball. And the ball itself rolls again inside of the hole. Now the water is lowering. In order to get to the treasure chest, go towards the first part where we started. Jump off and go towards here. There's a treasure chest and inside this treasure chest is a silver longsword with a strength of 22. Take it or leave it, it's all up to you. Walk out of there, up the ladder, back to this part, jump off again and glides towards this area. Up here. And now straight towards the monk. And press A. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Spirit orb, a symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. May the Goddess smile upon you. Alrighty then, next shrine finished! Are you ready for the next one? That one will go live next week. Thank you so much for watching and see you in my next video. See ya!